Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Anaris Gay, your most fabulous glam therapist. And today I was just doing our first glam therapy session. I hope I explained it well. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Definitely comment and tell me what y'all want to see. And we're currently deciding if we want to go live on Instagram, TikTok, or YouTube. So comment and let me know where y'all want to hang out at and do these chats. And I'll just let y'all see what happened. All right, good morning, y'all. Um, I'm back with another video. My name is Janae, and today I'm filming a glam therapy video. That's just where I like to get dressed, get ready, and chit chat. So I had a lot on my mind, and I'm actually kind of excited to um, film this today because I wanted to talk about things that was just going on. I had commented on someone else's channel. I was like, "Oh my gosh, thank you so much, you helped me start my channel." And some troll came over here talking about don't restart your channel and i'm like first of all so i clicked on their channel and they didn't have no picture of themselves nothing going on for yourself and so my point in saying that is don't ever let anyone who um don't ever let somebody who don't have anything going on try to tear you down when you're doing something for yourself because people will do that like people can hate sometimes and just whatever so anyway i'm just getting ready i'm just putting my jewelry on i'm just wearing these earrings that i got from charlie charlie forever ago i love this bracelet and i'm trying to just be like organic and just be myself but i really need to get ready because i don't want to just be on here in braids so i'll be right back here i've been on a hair journey because i a couple of months ago, I bleached my hair and it was doing stupid stuff to my hair. So I'm trying to fix it. So I'm wearing wigs right now. But it's not because I can't wear my real hair. I have real hair. It's just my battery on my camera is dying. Oh my God. Just let it charge because I didn't use it a lot yesterday. I'm so new to this YouTuber thing. Thank you to my girl Lillian. She really helped me. I asked for help on my wig situation. And she said, get some E-B-I-N Wonder Lace. So first I got to find out what that is. And she said, spray it on your finger and then tap it on the lace. Get a blow dryer and dry it. Then if you have a lace band, put it on it. And then put foundation on it. So I'm going to find out what that stuff is. I'm so new to the wave world. But it is a wonderful world. Like I, It's really nice. Right before I started filming, my daughter woke up and started crying. So I sent her with her dad to go get breakfast. But I had some things I really wanted to say. I'm taking the alcohol wipe and I just wipe. I put the wig cap on. What is this? Alcohol wipe. I know your wig cap is not supposed to be black. Remember that I'm very new to this. But it's so hard like to navigate life with other people sometimes because like you have your thoughts ideas and opinions of how you want to do things or how it should go and they have their thoughts and opinions of how they think things should go and who's right you know but yeah i just been feeling super motivated and inspired lately and i think y'all see the glow i've been getting so much more engagement on all my stuff thank y'all so much for your support by the way i really do appreciate it So yeah, we just painted the bathroom pink. I wanted it to be pink for my videos. And I've just been feeling so inspired and had so many ideas. But I had a lot of really, really, really deep thoughts. Because I I kind of wanted to talk about like overcoming like self-doubt and like haters, like people talking about you or if you like scared. But I need my makeup done before we have these deep conversations. So hold on. Alright, so all right, so I think I've really been liking the spray method. So like I did, I showed you guys, all I did was take a alcohol little swab and then I wiped the front in front of the wig cap and now I'm gonna just spray a little bit. Yeah, I 
just like the spray better than the glue. So all I've done this morning, I woke up, brushed my teeth. I used the, I don't know if I told y'all, I used the Moon, the Rose Moon Fluoride Free Kendall Jenner. Cute little Too Faced. Use the Heavenly from Victoria's Secret. This is one of my all time favorites. It smells really good. I've been wanting to get, there's this rose perfume at, um, at Sephora that I like. I am using, I'm still using some glue, but I'm just using that right here. And I like to just hold it. Now this is just like one, this is, I am one week. I only have one week's worth of knowledge with these wigs. But like I said, I really did want to get into some things. So let me stop playing around. So first and foremost, I just wanted to say that I feel like the biggest way I've grown from having my daughter is just like, I really don't want to waste time. Like I feel like in my 20s, I wasted a lot of time. Like I really slept on myself and my potential. And wow, I just like, wow. I feel like my eyes have been opened in a way that I just, I'm like, wow, I can't. It was right there, you know? But you live and you learn. I try my best not to live in regret because sometimes I'll get into being like, dang, I wish I would have did this. I wish I knew this sooner. I could have been so much farther ahead. But like I said, I said this in my Instagram story. You just have to know your strength and your weaknesses. You need to give yourself grace and forgive yourself and just, you know, move forward with the knowledge that you have now and just do your best. And the reason why I just started feeling so strongly about this is because I was thinking I was gonna film a um, pregnancy video, and I was thinking about because when I was pregnant, this um, influencer, Miss Jackie O, she passed away. Like I had never heard of her before she died. So after that, like you know, I'm pregnant. I was like sad, and so I watched her channel, and she had two girls and a boy, and. You know, being a new mom, you know, I just hope YouTube, I hope YouTube will be around forever and I hope my daughter can see these things and I just feel like, yeah, I want to make my channel so that hopefully she can watch it one day and I just feel like, I don't know, I feel like I have things that I want to say and that I want to talk about. So, I'm about to, I washed my face already, I just used the CeraVe that I've showed y'all, like, I don't know how many times. Um, but I'm going to use, which I don't, I do this whenever I'm recording. I put this moisturizer on first, but normally I'm supposed to use, I use the Fenty, the fat water. I usually wash my face fat water, then moisturizer, but I don't know where it is. It's right here. All right, I'm on. I think, yeah, I said it. I'm on my phone. My husband called. I hope my battery um charges up. I wanted, um, I hate when I say I'm um, a lot. That's so annoying. Anyways, I, um, when I woke up this morning, I came to the bathroom and I was so happy that it's painted pink. I've always wanted a pink room. My mom was not having that shit growing up. She was like, no, we're not painting your room pink. So to have this pink bathroom makes me really happy. But what I want to say is I woke up this morning and I came to the bathroom. I just happened to put on this song called Joy Unspeakable. And I was listening to it with my daughter. And I wasn't filming yet. So I didn't get any footage of us listening to that song. But I did record us listening to um, a little gospel song together. And I'm going to insert a clip. I thought about making all of my intro gospel songs just so the demons and the trolls will stay off my page, but yes, that was my point. That's what I wanted to say. My point is I hadn't even, when this happened, when this troll came on my page, I hadn't even uploaded a video yet. Like even that first get ready with me, which is so, that get ready with us, which is crazy. And I was trying to make sure my boob was not on the camera. But yeah, literally I hadn't even uploaded anything. I had just been recording things cause I wanted to make sure that I would be consistent. I do not like the way that lash turned out. Like, I want my lashes to be straight. Like, I feel like I keep going off topic. I'm trying to tell you that this troll came on my page when I said I was restarting my YouTube 
and I hadn't even uploaded it. My last upload was two years ago. Somebody came all out their way to come click on my little video and say that I shouldn't restart my channel. So I just feel like when someone throws hate at you like that, you know you gotta keep going. You like you gotta lean into it. So anyway, I'm about to foundation. We already know which foundation I use. If you don't know, go back and watch the first video. You really should watch it. You need to go and do I was gonna say you need to go and do your homework, but if we're gonna just be hanging out on these videos, if we're gonna just be getting to know each other like this, you probably should. So anyway, my concept for my channel, I was trying to think if I wanted to do, I'm just trying to think how I want everything to flow. Like it's a lot to think about because I call this, this is glam therapy to me. Like we're just hanging out, we're doing our makeup, we're getting ready for today. I knew I wanted to do these like glam therapy videos, but I never knew how to intro them. So, hey everyone, it's a neighbor's game, your favorite glam therapy. You know, I'm not 100% sure, but I think I. I think the concept of glam therapy for me came up when I watched this show, Sabrina, and one of the demons was a glamour. And it's like something that entices you and reels you in. So I thought that was um, fitting to call myself your glam therapist because first of all, I love glam. I love things, makeup. But I'm going to tell you some real stuff and not the 